Here's our round card, girl. It is round two, ladies and gentlemen, in a big way. That two stands for more than just the round two. But Polly, looking at that first round, with Aponte, Aponte came out in that first round, as the first round does go to the red corner, so Capiello wins the first round, but Aponte came out and put up a fierce defense against Capiello, and then Capiello wore him down, wore him down, and managed to get round one. This is round two. Quickly, Aponte backed up into his own corner by Capiello. He tries to punch his way free. The unorthodox style of Aponte trying to tie up Capiello. Capiello is straight on meat and potatoes puncher. He'll go upstairs, downstairs. The endurance factor here may come into play. Favoring Capiello, who just drives his opponent the Ponte into the ropes and stings him with an overhand right. That was a nice overhand right right over his left jab. But he's got to do a lot more of a little rock. He's got to stay on his opponent. And maybe he's just uh, playing possum with him for a while to get some exercise because I think uh, little rock could take this guy away right away. There's nothing behind Aponte's punches, and he is on fumes right now. You can see him gasping for air. Oh, nice left hand by uh, Capiello. Oh, a combination, and he stuns Aponte. Aponte is wounded. He goes down to an E. He's going to take a stand in eight. That is not a little rock. That's a freaking boulder. Yep, he threw some uh, nice, nice lightning shots there, and the uh, opponent got right up. Uh, there were good body shots, took the wind out of him. He's catching his wind right now. But uh, he's a game kid, the other fighter. He's got a lot of guts, but he's not doing much in there. He's on the skewer now. That's just a matter of just putting him on the rotisserie and wait until he's done because he's out in the fire. He just swings wildly there. Oh, man. Capiello goes to town, misses with the left, follows up with the right, now ties him up. The fighter spread eagle to the far side of the ring. Look at Aponte. He's dazed and confused, and we ain't talking about no Led Zeppelin album here. He's just hanging on for dear life. It's just a matter of time of when he's going to fall. And now the Little Rock is turning him into gravel. Down to one knee. It's going to be stopped. He doesn't know where he is. Aponte. Little, Little Rock is going to finish this guy off because he's making him look bad now. He's going to be able to take a guy out now instead of him hanging. He's exhausted. He's He's out of gas. He took some good blows to the kidneys and, and the body area. But uh, Little Rock's got to take him out because he's making him look bad right now. Yeah, he's sleepy. Sleepy in a big way. But he valiantly tries to fight his way free. Oh, a vicious right hand takes a pony to the canvas as he's counted down by Tommy Gorman. He's not going to respond from that one. It's lights out. Go to bed, Grandma. Mike Capiello, the Little Rock, goes to 24 and 3. Aponte falls to 5 and infinity. This one's over. Now, Nick Previty having some words with Charlie. That's it. Capiello wins that one. Polly, you called it. Yes, he, uh, had to, he had to get rid of that opponent, in which he did. He's a good little fighter, Capiello. He got good moves, looks like a good trained fighter. Got some good people in his corner. I know them, and they're good trainers. And uh, just type of a kid like him does make you look bad because you can't catch up with him. He's moving all different angles and uh, a little awkward and a little crazy style. But uh, Capiello caught up on him, which was good, and uh, took him out of there. I think Aponte's pretty lucky that uh, he can sit down right now and he can uh, talk to his corner because uh, there's ways you can go out lightly like he did tonight or he can go out on a stretcher like we've seen other fighters. That's right. Well, uh, he could have took on more of a beating and probably uh, got knocked out and been laid out in a, in a more serious way than he did. So it's better that it stopped like that. Of course, the fans don't like that type of a, a fight. And, uh, and, and, and so you, you can't go with always with the fans. you got to go with the safety of boxing. And that's what we're doing tonight. And we have to stress, safety is the key factor. There's Mike Little Rock Capiello. He wins a third round knockout.